Hi guys, this is Saurav, and uh, we all know that we uh, we all have very limited time to create an app, okay, for the hackathon. So there's one trick and method you can implement it in your app. So here's a lot of AIF file, okay. So you can use these all AIF file to create your own app. You can modify that app, and you can get a get an idea about uh, the app. and you can get the code from that one apps okay so here here's two websites you can find the code and they all codes are very amazing and super so how we can find so you will see you just need to type the free download.aif file in google and you will find the howlooks.com that's the website here uh, this is very useful website i found it so open this website and you will see here there are 150 complete projects and they all are like you know they are very very uh, amazing project amazing ai files here here uh, and most of the uh, apps are in tangible okay so you don't need to worry you just need to uh, download this file okay uh, go to the any app like if you want to download this chat pro dot ai file for tangible so go to that one link and you will find the link for the dot ai file you will see here download chat pro dot ai file now you can just click on this file and you can download that one file okay so you have to import this file in mit app inventor in some apps uh, they will get uh, you will get the error that uh, this feature is not supported in mit app inventor okay there are very few files are there that are not supported in uh, app inventor otherwise almost all files are supported okay so one website is that one and second website is the coding bus dot info and you will find here app inventor just click on that app inventor and you will see here there are lot of apps here talking apps and there are you know uh, space image spread file and there are all uh, apps file here dot aif file so you can download that aif file and use it in your app okay because we we don't have a time to write a full code for any app so you can copy the code from other apps and use that one code in your own app okay so fine so that's the two method to create the amazing app in uh, in a very few days in a few, uh, very few time okay so if you have any doubt you can ask me on comment and please don't forget to subscribe for more updates have a nice day be safe bye bye <laughs>